Hey guys, it is Shirley and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. I believe that this is the first 2020 cash envelope sinking fund stuffing and that's pretty exciting. So before we get started, make sure you go and subscribe down below. Let me know if you are loving these videos. These are ultimately, these are my favorite, favorite videos to film. I love counting my money. I love stuffing them. I love seeing where it goes and watching it grow and all that stuff. So if you are liking these cash stuffings let me know down below and let me know if you are doing any of these or have a channel in general I would love to go and support you guys get to know you guys and maybe become friends all right so this paycheck it was it was okay so my annual I and my annual or respected I said twelve hundred dollars but I got paid one thousand two hundred and twenty five dollars so a lot of the money did go towards bills so we are not going to have a lot of stuff to a lot of money to stuff my sinking funds and you will see that all right so for car we did three hundred and two dollars rent we did 261 that's actually switched they did that wrong. Well, I did that wrong. My bad. Um, car is usually two forty eight, and then rent is usually two ninety. So I did that wrong. Anyways, um, MediaCom is seventeen dollars. Phone I didn't have to pay for it because it was my birthday. Insurance we're putting seventy one dollars. Light bill is forty two dollars. Credit card is thirty eight dollars. Loan is $64. Okay. And then gym is $35. All right. So that is everything. Those are all of my bills. So we are going to go ahead and total that out. So that's $302 plus 261 plus 17 plus 71 plus 42, plus 38, plus 60, oop, I messed that up, no, why did I do that, okay, 302, 261, 17, 71, 42, 38, 64, and 35 will equals 2, eight hundred and thirty dollars so that is how much our bills are so we're going to subtract that from one thousand two hundred and twenty five dollars so we have three hundred and ninety five dollars to work with so i'm just going to write it right here left over all right you guys so let's go and do our cash envelope. So I'm going to get it situated. So we have $395 to work with. All right, let's see. Groceries, as always, is going to be $60. So let me move this over and get this settled. Actually, I'm going to move this out of the way. And I did already go and get my cash out. So we're just going to talk while I finish this. Anyways, I am super excited because I actually get to do these videos now because I ha haven't gotten to do it. I'm going to zoom you out just a little bit. And I literally, I have missed it so much, you guys. And let me know what your favorite video is. These truly are my favorite All right, so that is that. All right, so first off, groceries is going to be, well, I usually do 80, but we're actually going to do, or 100, we're actually going to do 80 now. But this is how much I had left, 20, 21, 22, 23. $3 will go towards wedding, and then $20, I'm going to actually break it up. I have to get some smaller bills, and then you'll see where that goes later on. 
So groceries are actually going to be eighty dollars. So that's fifty, sixty, seventy, and eighty. All right, gas will always be sixty dollars. I don't have anything. One, two, three, two forty and sixty. Fun money is usually it if he's between like eighty dollars, sixty dollars, fifty dollars. This time we're just going to do forty. All right, out to eat. We are not putting anything in there. Try not to go out to eat much. And then for Cushing will be 50 plus 38. So we're going to put $88. All right, so we're going to write $80, $60, $40, $50, $60, $70, $80. And then sinking funds will do the total at the end. All right, so I'm going to get situated, and we're actually going to do our sinking funds in a minute. And those are going to be super fun. So I will be back in like two seconds. All right, you guys, so it is our sinking fund part now, and we are actually going to be just putting $63. So that is that. It's $43 plus the $20 that I had left over from the grocery fund. So we're just going to, as always, go down the list. And then we're going to count it and see what our total. And then write down our totals down here. So it's going to be not that great this week, you guys. All right. So for college, we're not going to put anything. Medical, we are going to be putting $45. Car maintenance, we're going to be putting ten. Special occasion, we're going to put eight dollars. Vacation, we're going to put zero. Christmas and Black Friday will be zero also. Wedding is actually going to be six dollars, and that's from the extras for my grocery. And then actually, I also found three dollars in my wallet earlier, so that's going to go towards wedding also. Beauty and clothing will be zero dollars. Gifts, zero, and tag, zero. All right, so the total, and I'm actually going to use this one because it's actually a lot faster for me. 45 plus 10 plus 8 plus 6. $69 is how much we're going to put towards sinking funds, which, you know, you guys, that's okay. You know, there's always next week, or in two weeks, actually, because that's when I get paid. All right, so we're going to get our envelopes and then stuff them so this shouldn't take very long all right let's see college as always will have zero but let's see if we have any money in here no money so we're just going to set that aside medical doesn't have anything so we're actually going to put 45 dollars 20 30 40 and 45, 20, 30, 40, 45. And I actually have an unexpected bill that popped up, so that's great. So now I gotta save that also. All right, let's see. What is next? Car maintenance. So, car maintenance is actually going to get. 10 and we do have some money in there so 50 60 70 80 and then we're going to have 5 and 10 so that's going to make it 90 and if you haven't watched my video these are my new cash envelopes from Katie Co and her stuff will be down below and the link to that video will be at the very end so that's $90. Special occasion, which is the weddings that I'm going to have to attend, bachelorettes, bridal showers, all that. So we're going to put $8 in there. Let me get this $8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. So let's see how much money we have. 20, 30, 35, 36, 37... 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46. 
$46 for special occasion, which I think the bachelorette is in March. Say 47, yeah. All right, vacation is zero, which I don't think we have anything because I literally just went to Tennessee. Christmas has zero, I believe, also. Um, let's see. Black Friday would definitely have zero. All right, and then the last money that I actually have is from my extra. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. And that is actually going to go in wedding. So here's my wedding one. It's a big one because I got to save a lot of money, you guys. Two, four, six, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Two, four, six, eight. So eighty seven. So it's adding up slowly, but I don't think I have anything in beauty and clothing. Nope. I'm just making a mess everywhere. Guys, you can tell that I'm out of the loop because I have not um, done a cash envelope and sinking fund in a while. So I'm like stumbling over my words. Ugh, I hate it. Um, gifts. Let's see what gifts has. Nothing. And then tag. I know they have something. So that has $15. And I know I have to say 80 Oh, maybe like 150 so, but that's not due until like May or June, and then I have, I have a ton of left. All right, so let's do total-wise. So, let's see, there's 45 plus 90 plus 47 plus 87 plus 15. So, we have $284. So that's actually, it's not bad. It's probably one of my lowest, actually, my lowest sinking fund amount. How much was it? 284 was sinking fund. But yeah, so that is my, that, that literally is my lowest sinking fund. But you know what? It's fine. We're going to build all of this back up. I need to stay over at work. I need to do a lot of stuff. But anyway, so that is it, you guys. I hope y'all are having a great week. Hopefully I have a great weekend because I am going to be posting this on Saturday. So, and this is Friday when I'm like filming, but I have to work. So yeah, got to pre-film it, you guys. But anyways, I hope y'all enjoy it. Let me know what y'all think. I know I'm like stumbling over my words. I am not, I haven't been doing these videos in quite some time. So forgive me. It's going to be better next time. But anyways, I love you guys and I'll see you guys later. Bye.